Hello once again, and thank you for tuning into The Platformer. You're currently watching our Let's Play of Bastion. For more Let's Plays, co-op commentaries, and other shenanigans, simply subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. We'll all be better off once the Bastion is complete. We're mm, getting there, aren't we? What? What do you want? Fix that thing right up, didn't we? Made these goings on a little livelier. The monument's getting better. Zolf sure did a number on it, though. Alright, so I'm assuming two more. Suppose it's true a little song can put things in perspective. Hmm. Ah. Awesome. so much more the conscience we haven't lost everything long as we have that looks like I have more videos to take care of in the future I did take care of the one yes, okay. of just a couple shards left the quarry's gotta have one right hmm I would assume so Imagine everything you'd need to build a city like Ceylandia. It takes hard work and planning, and it also takes a burstone quarry. That's weird. The Ura tunnels beneath the quarry must have softened the blow from the calamity. Oh, that doesn't... Same goes for its natives. Rattletails. I don't like this. Tales ain't the worst of it either, but more about that. Wait, in a what? Bit. He was on my side. Fine. Jerk. The quarry came with a lifetime supply of windbags. Windbags smaller than the naked eye can see are nesting in those rocks. Well, that's um, kind of weird. But there was even more to it than that. rocks a source of life. We found that the oldest ones remember things. Uh, move this 
switch it. There we go. Wow. That was pretty pro. Um... They're recording oh, everything. Maybe I should. All the time. Taking it all in. Get out of here. The quarry's secrets ain't exactly obvious. Take them both out. Whose side is he on? No wonder all those beasts were drawn to the quarry. The rocks were calling them. There we go. Keeping the quarry free from the past turned out to be a problem. Rattletails kept tunneling in the snack on wood bags. Wind bags tended to the rocks, so we had to keep the rattletails at bay. There we go, that's it, that's it. Without those wind bags, the quarry might not have its special qualities. That's a pretty uh, psychedelic quarry. Even stink eyes started taking root in here. Alright. What are you doing? Why would the Ura sell off such a fascinating place? The Ura always were a superstitious lot. He's just being weird. Might be the gods told him the quarry's bad news. Um, I was playing this by ear. <laughs> yeah, that'll be fine. Okay, assuming he doesn't just turn like that. Although I think I want to go that way. In any case, it's fair to say the quarry was a godsend. Those rocks, all polished to a mirror sheen. So there's also stuff this way. this oh yeah this is less exciting -ing. less exciting that wasn't as exciting as I was expecting all right so I need to go that way
Oh wait. I just use this to my advantage. Like so. Um Alright, whatever. The largest ones, you know as cores. Come on. A single core can keep the lights on in an entire city district. That looks really green over there. Smaller ones, we call them shards. Shard's got a fraction of a core's power, enough to fuel a voyage to the motherland. Wow. Well, now the quarry's all dried up. These rocks are much too young to be a use. See something over there. Over yonder this way. Remember how I said rattle tails ain't the worst thing in the quarry? Uh, that honor goes to a beast we took the calling. Sir Lunky. Sir Massive Lunky. Thing stomped many of our boys. We just couldn't get rid of him. The only thing harder than the rocks burst on the quarry is Sir Lunky's head. Wow. His big fat runs plenty tough too. So is a kid. We never could get stubborn old Lunky to leave the quarry alone. Whew. Then the kid hears a voice calling from down the hall. Are you alright? It says. I didn't hear it. But, I mean, that wasn't as challenging as I was expecting. It was difficult, so I guess I'm okay. I'm not dead. You. It's him. I've come to warn you, he says. What do you want? The Bastion is under siege. Let it fall. You should not go back. Kid hears him, but he ain't about to be deterred. If that's the way it is, he says, then I won't stop you. Alright. Because my countrymen will. Oh, that's fantastic. I sense a war coming on. <laughs>